Do this. All right, guys, good morning. So, one away to Hobby Lobby here in Rancho. So, I'm gonna drop off my wife right here, and everything's gonna go good. Hopefully, she has a good day at work. Hey, and then we're gonna head off to HQ, see how everybody's doing over there, and see what Rob needs help with. Let's go ahead and do that. Whoop. Yo, what is up guys? Good morning. Uh, I just pulled up to HQ and I wanted to show you guys real quick what the a new installment on the Subi was. I, mean, I posted it on my IG, but um, just wanted to show you guys real quick what I added to the Subi. So let me show you. I added <laughs> the trunk. So Saibon trunk, I wish I would have done a video on it, of installing it, because it was kind of, uh, damn, I had to drill some holes into the to the trunk so it could fit, because it didn't have some holes. But it's okay, I got it done. This is how it looks. Oh my God, dude, look how fucking dirty it is. I don't know if you can see that on camera. Damn, bro. Ay, ay, ay. I'll probably go take that to clean today. That's basically what it is right here. Oh my God, the car's fucking dirty already, man. The fucking rain be fucking it up. There it is. guys bike is loaded up a big shout out to chai thank you so much for letting me borrow this caesar i'm gonna pick you up we're head over to sky park ready let's go and today we're not taking the ghost we're gonna take oh the dreaded e-bike i'm just kidding i love the e-bike bam and just like that we're loaded up i gotta go pick up a friend that's his first time riding so this is the perfect opportunity to show you guys what to do when you guys get there ready let's teleport yeah we'll see mountain biking in this weather uh okay uh, I'm down. Good morning, everyone. It is very, very cold. We got Caesar loading up right here. Let me swing around and show you guys what we're working with right now. Holy crap. It is complete 100% fog. Our bikes are right here right now. Anyways, let's offload and see what we can do. It is so cold and so wet. Caesar, we're crazy. It is like wet. It's really nice riding through here. It's uh, misty. It's not quite raining, but it's really misty, real foggy. So the lens is definitely dirty. But this is the view of just Driver post all the way up and biking normal, flight incline. Money line, I'm a run it every time. Give me mine, going up, need no decline. Money line, I'm a run it every time. Give me mine, going up, need no decline. Yeah, 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 yeah. Watch it, catch your own. Yeah, nah, need my ass. Yeah, yeah, watch it, catch your own. Hello, my name is Kim, and we are going to be taking pictures today with Disobey. We're gonna start doing some branding for it. Hi, my name is Sophia. Um, I drive a Supra. So I got the Supra about a week ago and I've been putting about 100 miles a day because I'm trying to break it in to 1,200 miles and just like start modifying it. I love it so far. I used to be cool and I actually got out of the car scene because I went to school full time. <laughs> so now I'm modifying cars again. So I might be cool. What's up boys? We got our first casualty today. So this is what happens when you, um, you bomb the hill and you hit some mud. And then this is what happens on a wood wall. So this, this is bent right here, if you can look at it. So right now we're at the uh, repair shop waiting for them to see what they can do. Oh, I took the fucking thing. Yeah, I'm good. Is my bike good is the question. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. 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 Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's up? Okay guys, so we got the crazy car all cleaned up. We're gonna run inside real quick and get Melanie and let's see what she thinks about the cleaned up crazy car. Oh. <laughs> I don't know about that one. <laughs> It looks good, right? So this doesn't have brakes at all. So we have to be very careful. What is this? Is this not a brake? Okay, so that's basically, <laughs> okay, that's the e-brake, but that's the jerk. So this lifts the back, so your backside kind of whips. So I'm gonna fall forward is what you're talking about. <laughs> so when you lift that, your car goes side, or the little car goes sideways. Ah. Uh... Yeah, so you can like jerk. We'll see, but we'll see how it goes. 
Any last, any last comments? Uh, mom, I love you. Okay, guys, so I'm gonna drive it just around right here for a little bit. I'm not Mike's level yet. I'm basically a beginner. Well, let's do it. Mike. I got here in the morning. I typically try to print in the morning with the guys just to get them ahead. And then I've got to actually go to AAA and do some car stuff. And then also I've got to do some finances for the team for last month's numbers. So uh, you guys know we're partners for uh, for the DME brand. So we closed out May and now I have to work the numbers to make sure everyone gets paid out correctly because we're all partners. But that's about it. And probably talk about filming after we get off, get off camera. We're gonna talk about mountain bike stuff. Oh, by the way, look, I got more cuts. Hold on. Oh, damn. Yo, I'm not, I'm not even lying. This is weird. If you guys don't want to hear weirdness, like leave. Yo, my 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 lower body is hella big. That's what she said. <laughs> Michael. Michael. Michael, please. There he is. Please. There he is. Come on. That, you know? <laughs> no, I'm saying, I'm like, my lower body has developed a lot, like my legs and my ass, my calves. Yeah. They're a lot bigger because all my pants are, you, you slicked up my ass, you know. <laughs> no, I mean like it's tighter, like it's, because back in college, I, all I did was lower body stuff because I was defensing. So my legs have always been really big, but the last few years have been smaller. But after biking, it's like fucking, yeah, you're gonna have cake when you start biking. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, that's what I'm doing. Okay, bye. Wow, look how dirty this is. My goodness. So I'm gonna wash all this out so nothing rusts. That's fun though, but my shoes are a mess. They held up real nice. I'll do a full review on this, but my socks are not wet. Excuse the mess guys, but we're here with my wife who is the tarantula keeper. So right now she's basically feeding some of my tarantulas and we're gonna see if we can get some nice feeding footage for you guys. Ooh, that was awesome. Dang, she got that real good. This tarantula is called a Versicolor. She's always been a good feeder, or eater, sorry. I hope you guys can see that, it's very difficult because I have to zoom in a lot for this little guy. But I'm pretty sure I captured it. Yo, I had some of you guys ask me on Instagram for my Funko Pop collection, so I'm gonna show you a little bit. A uh, little life hack for Funko Pops, if you guys use a baseball bat case, I think it shows them off pretty cool. My more, a little bit expensive ones, like I got my Mewtwo, these dolls are normal. I got my Mewtwo, Mr. Mime, Bulbasaur, Squirtle, Charmander, and then I got Pikachu. <laughs> My DBZ one. <laughs> so this is my DBZ collection. My most expensive one was Beerus or probably Vegeta. This Vegeta one was really hard to get. The only way to get this one, they were like doing like a, a giveaway. So I had to buy like three and I got lucky and I ended up getting the, the rare one. The bigger ones, they were like, I think these were like 60 bucks at Frank's. So I borrowed this rack from Chai, my neighbor. One thing my mom and my brother and my everyone in my family pretty much taught me was, you borrow something, you gotta give it back in the same condition. I told him I'll be right there and I'll clean it up, but he said no need to clean it up, just drop it off. But just, you know, being mature about it, someone let you borrow something, give it back in the same condition. 
I think it's just responsible and smart.